Uh, Mark Jones, not he's gone crazy, right? Mark Jones, some of you know, he calls college football games for uh, ESPN. I think he also does NBA games. I, I don't know. He was actually a fairly talented broadcaster until he lost his mind during the Trump era on social media. Uh, and this Mark Jones guy really went crazy. Was it last year or the year before that? when he said that he would no longer accept police escorts uh, to college football games because he was afraid the police were going to kill him. It's crazy. His brain is broken. And he now sits around on social media all day, and his brain gets more and more broken. And he recently liked a tweet calling Stephen A. Smith a coon for Stephen A. Smith's opinion of the Jerry Jones 65-year-old story. And so... What's wild about this is Stephen A. Smith has responded and basically called out Mark Jones without using his name. But what about ESPN on ESPN editorial standards here? If you call your coworker a racial slur, most businesses would have consequences for that. And I don't blame Stephen A. Smith for looking around and being like, look, I'm busting my ass every day I am the most talented, I think this is true, and the most important and the hardest working employee at all of ESPN. I think that's true of Stephen A. Smith. I respect the work because it's not easy to do as many hours of television as he's doing. It's not easy to do as much media as he is doing. I think he's talented. I think he's really entertaining on television. But if I'm Stephen A. Smith, I'm looking around saying, wait a minute, you let this dude who doesn't even matter that much Mark Jones is pretty easy to replace. You let this dude inside of our own company call me a racial slur because of an opinion I have that I shared on the ESPN airwaves and there are zero consequences? I'm sorry, if I'm Stephen A, he may be a better dude than me. I'm looking over at Mark Jones. I'm saying, you better do something to this crazy dude calling me a coon, racial slur insult when he doesn't even matter to this company and I'm out there making ESPN tens of millions of dollars on the shows that I'm doing, I'm sorry. There should be consequences. 